has really fallen off the last four games. Minnesota coming in, dropping three straight games, and now another Minnesota native, Stephen Crowell, the right hand. Baby hook goes. Gave up 44 paint points in that loss to Michigan State last time out. Payne trying to counter, can't. Trying to rip that ball away from Crowell. He does, and he'll score. Grove, Minnesota. Here's Wall, finding an open crease. Wall underneath will kick it out. A.J. Store can score from anywhere on the floor, including. But a 29 against Indiana alone on Friday. Hepburn cut off by Hawkins, and now here's Crowell. Trying to pack his man down. That's Garcia, no double team here. And the field, slow start offensively. That has plagued his team at times, certainly in the first half. Here's Hawkins trying to end the drought. Can't. And one and done, Store the ring. Gilmore is on the field. Wisconsin without guard Kamari McGee here tonight did not make the trip. A little body injury that he suffered against Indiana Payne with the miss. But tips. Another turnover. Third Wisconsin turnover. Mitchell for three. And the friendly roll to make this a two point. Hawkins, he'll attack, kick it out. Garcia, that's going to be a deep shot, and it goes. And Gardort. Fox the rebound. Garcia had been two for his last 17 from three before knocking that last one down. Here's Hawkins. Wild shot. Was Crowell, he has that in his arsenal and for good reason. If you're a big float that way, then you kick it back to Crowell. That made field goal snap to drought of about three and a half minutes. Fox hangs and scores off the glass. Klesman will pull up and knocks down the jumper just outside the free throw line. Sleep for a while. And Gilmore had an angle, brought it down. Maybe he regretted that last yep. move, but now Klesman will try and attack blocked by five. He's not having to look as much to be as assertive as he was a season ago, and a lot of guys aren't willing to do that. And on cue, he takes a three. And he knocks it down. Necessarily see what led to it, but that's a tough one if you're Christie. Nolan Winter checking in for the first time from nearby Lakeville, Minnesota. He left that one short. Christie did not sub out after picking up his second foul. Isaiah Enan at the scores table. He will check in shortly. Christie with a miss. Rebound. Nice job by Ola Joseph of not allowing Hepper to turn the corner. Ola Joseph will stop and score off the glass. Could have settled for the three. Yep. Payne sets the screen. Mitchell at the elbow. No. Yeah, they lead the conference in defensive rebounding percentage at 78%. Connor Sejan is playing time has dwindled here and scores. The difficulty of teams going on the road and winning. Good point. There's Wall against Payne. Goes baseline and he was fouled on the floor. Something Wall good that there wasn't anything coming at him. He's able to turn and face up. There's foul on Payne as Klesman knocks down the three, hit the deck. Time store got Enan up. Dangerous pass tip, but it's Klesman. The four to shoot, crosses over, launches up. Top oh. and off the glass. Warren awfully quiet right now with five to shoot. Fancy dribbling, but lost it. Now it's Ola Joseph. Hawkins will fire up top for three. No good. It's nine from the field. Down nine, Payne the double. Carrington will try again. That one doesn't go, and Hepburn, Kim Madison has been great. And Ola Joseph brought it low. Husband on the floor, turnover Minnesota. And now Storm will attack again. And maybe get some foul shots to see the ball go through and kind of stem this momentum that Wisconsin has. Garcia is a good free throw shooter yeah. as Mitchell with the miss. And the thing he had to do was funnel toward the sideline. You know, if, you, if you're Garcia or Payne, demand the ball down there on the block. Store fades away and scores over Eden. Hawkins to Mitchell. Five to shoot. Back door, Eden. Baseline. Kicks it back out. Mitchell will fire again. That's an air ball and against Mitchell. Now Wall underneath against Payne, lowers the shoulder and scores. And Ben John. Here's Garcia. Doesn't go. Eden, the putback, yes. So if you are Minnesota offensively, you have to at least swing the ball from side to side and force the defense maybe into a potential scramble situation. Windsor knocks it down. Crossing over. Beats Hawkins and misses. Got it back. 
Klesman off the fake. He'll reset and fire, and that one is short. A good rebound by Payne. And a good job Been for a long time now for the Gophers here in the Twin Cities. And adding to that even more next season. Hawkins, the shot front blinding down. Able to bury a See it now trying to back wall down. It's not there. Late clock for Enid. Does he see it? Lowers the shoulder and a, let's see, conflicting signals here. They made eye contact and then made a decisive call. Well done. 16 foul. Next one will put Minnesota at the line. Carrington baseline. Jay, yes. Attack the rim. Especially when you shoot 83% from the line. Wall sets the screen for score and he knocks it down. Now they have three wins, but this has been familiar territory for Minnesota in league play so far this year. A siege in, ooh, he got a bump there from Carrington on the drive. Hawkins, five, down low, Fox, land, good. We're very fortunate to deficit. So Badgers by ten, Wisconsin has won six in a row against Minnesota. Here's Hawkins, he'll fire for three, and there's a good start for Minnesota here in the second. Payne will square up Crowell. Crowell has two fouls. Payne drives, hands, and scores. Really well done. This has been very closely played despite Wisconsin's dominance. Here's Hawkins reversing and scoring. Hepburn will pull up outside the foul line. Rolled out, but there is Storm for the rebound. Christie thought it's Hepburn. Shot clock is at seven. Here's Payne with three to shoot in the paint, tied up, loose, and a jigger against Minnesota as the Badgers head coach. Another three from Hawkins. Look out, this guy can get hot. Storm against Payne. No. Wall, the offensive rebound. Yes! Woo! Tyler Wall, another second chance bucket for was in the rim. And if Wall's going to contest it, make him come through you. Storr got around Christie, and Christie with a big volleyball. Now, cut the four. Shot clock is late. It's at three. Hepburn's got his back to the basket. It's Wall left open for three, and that high-arcing shot ball. It shakes. He's got to demand the ball. Look where the arms are. He's got to have his elbows bent and asking for the basketball in that post situation. Just as Ben Jones. Probably a little quick if you're Wisconsin. Christie wants to join in and does. Tyler Wall, one on one against Payne. Brings him down low. Two native Minnesotans and Wall knocks it in as Christie. Garcia trying to save it. Mitchell does in the corner. The Wall defensively has been stellar down there on the line. Christie, no. And have Wall to Crowell. Growl against Garcia, goes left oh. and scores. Do you ever use it in the game, meaning they're offhand? Every post player from Wisconsin puts in enough time that they're confident going with the offhand in the game situation. Oh. When Mitchell's begging for the ball, and Wall, he collapsed. He closed Mitchell now in traffic. Christie, this for the lead. Gilmore trying to save it, did, but to Hawkins. Here's Garcia off his hands. Bad pass. Bad. That's a four-point swing. That's a four. Me be able to plant that foot on the three-point line and get an easy back door. John Blackwell, the Big Ten freshman of the week, and drives and scores a four. Decided by six or fewer. Off the screen. And three goals for Klesman. Well... He's not played much here tonight. Wall against Payne, backing him down in that low block. Patient right hand score. Give up. You have to demand the basketball. There's Hawkins. He'll throw it up off the rim and in. I think he wanted to. Down six against Crow. And in. I mean, turnover, Wisconsin. Garcia, open three from the win. To shoot. 
Garcia. He's got to go. He's just got to go. With three, settles for a deep two, and he ties the game. Shot clock again under 10. Mitchell to Garcia. Wall denying baseline. Garcia off the window and in. Final two minutes. Hawkins against Hepper, and that's tipped by Klesman and a turnover. Storr flying the other way. Storr ducks it down. Off the turnover. Gophers have just one timeout remaining. Mitchell feeds Payne, brought it low, but first a walk. And now Klesman, he'll attack, left it short, Storr trying to duck it no. down. Oh, it won't count, it was pretty. It's Garcia with five. Takes a deep three, it's no good. Carrington puts it off, foul. Braden. And Carrington does a nice job of coming from the weak side. Carrington 74% at the line. Carrington misses the second. In a scoring situation, you may want to give the foul on him. Score, strip, but foul. Small one for A.J. Score. Nailed it. Got it. Looking down low, it's Hawkins with 10, with 9. Fades with his hit, no whistle. Garcia, and now it's gone. Career game. Huge. Front court over here necessarily, but you force him side to side to burn some clock now. The clock is your friend. Knocks it down. And some big free throws. He's going to try to get it. He has, it has to hit the basket first. He does miss it. Got it back. Mitchell. No. Tipped out. No. And that'll do it. And off the miss. Mitchell had a good look. But Wisconsin and another nail biter at the barn. What, what a tremendous finish, but Corey, it pays off the